ever since some recent changes in Dev Studio, especially, if, let's see what version I'm in, especially since 4.6.3.52, uh, people have been wondering where uh, the rigidity settings went. So, uh, just as a quick refresher, rigidity is used to tell a follower item, such as I have this shirt here. Maybe I want the sleeves that are kind of puffy to um, not really get deformed when it, when things morph, but then it'll still follow the arm as it as it changes shape a little bit. You can have a little bit of control that way. Uh, it's more commonly used on, on dangling things on clothing or uh, such as a loincloth that bees hanging down. Uh, you might set it on that so it'll follow the morphs okay without getting distorted too badly. Or it might be useful for tails or other things like that that stick out. Uh, you get them to follow the geometry where they attach. Uh, so anyway, rigidity is found under the geometry editor tool here. If I click that, Go to tool settings. Let's see. There used to be a rigidity uh, setting under here, or a group type, and it's not here anymore. It's actually moved under uh, vertices. So the if you go under the vertice mode, then you can have your rigidity groups. So it's pretty much the same as before. Everything acts the same except for it's now based on the the vertice selections. Uh, the if you are used to using the facets as you're selecting and you find that that's easier way to select your verts that you're going to to do then when you have your facet selection just go ahead and right click in the viewport you can go to geometry selection convert selection convert to vertex selection and it actually switches your selection to vert mode and then it also converts that polygon selection to vertices so you can go ahead and still um, select your groups however you prefer and then convert them into the, the vertex selection and then be able to set your groups create rigidity group from selected and there you go you've got it and then if you want to go in and edit the rigidity group options. Uh, that shows up here under Geometry Assignment Rigidity Group Editor. I believe if you don't have a rigidity group that won't show up so let's go ahead and test that. Okay, I don't have any rigidity groups. Go under Geometry Assignment and see the rigidity group editor is gone but I still have my Create Rigidity Group options. And now it's back. Okay, uh, and otherwise everything works the same. And that's it.